Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel for another interesting beer review and the beer from the Suttler Brauerei, the oldest family brewer in the world. Uh, at least that's what they claim themselves and I have no reason to doubt that. Founded in uh, 1447, uh, located in Rettenberg in uh, Allgoy, so it's the absolutely most southern part of Bavaria to the border of Austria. You can't go more uh, south than this in Germany. Really, really beautiful, as you might know. I love Bavaria and especially the nature in southern Bavaria. So feel free to check out the uh, the uh, brewery's website and the pictures of the brewery. I'll link to it in the description box below, as always. Uh, I've also found um, a YouTube video uh, which the brewery has been creating about their brewery, which I will also link to in the description box below. Uh, and uh, this one is some uh, something that I've been looking for uh, because this is their most uh, I would say their flagship beer it's their gold which is their export I'm gonna speak about that later on what that is uh, but uh, the logo is their eagle which is quite um, quite known this logo uh, except of that the bottle looks very typical German maybe a little bit uh, boring not that many not that much that happens on the on the bottle in my opinion but that's uh, the way that they're having it and uh, very easy looking um, show you the cap here as well of their uh, eagle which is their logo and uh, it's as I said very beautiful located in uh, the small town of Rettenberg in uh, Algoy uh, just uh, in the in the valley uh, beside of the big mountain Grünten. Um, I'm gonna read a little bit about the the history of this uh, brewery Suttler Brauerei founded 1447. Uh, so really old. Um, the the um, private Brauerei Suttler GmbH is a brewery in Rettenberg in the Ober Allgoy district. About 45,000 hectoliters of beer are produced annually. The history of the Suttler brewery goes back to a brewery founded in 1447 at the foot of the Grünten mountain by an innkeeper who was not specified. This led to uh, Theologian Manfred Gohl to claim that the Suttler brewery was the oldest family brewery in Germany. Gohl's statements were featured in the news magazine Der Spiegel in 2004. The brewery took over the trademark rights and the cons uh, customers of the Postbrauerei Karl Meyer Nesselwang on December 1st, 2009 with a purchase contract of August 10, um, 2009. The private brewery Suttler brews different types of beer including 1447 Naturally Cloudy, which is a Keller beer, uh, Suttler Gold and Suttler Gold Alcohol Free, Bavarian Hell, Pils, Hefeweizen Hell, Hefeweizen Alcohol Free, Hefeweizen uh, Pale and Dark, St. Stefan's Bock, Corbinian Dunkel, Festbeer Maibock, Full Moon Beer, as well as the festival beer for the Algoi Festival Weeks since um, 2010. Suttler also produces three beers from Postbrauerei Algoi brand and soft drinks from the Alpina C brand. Uh, in addition, the brewery has been producing two lemonades under the Suttler Berg Limo brand since 2013, which consists exclusively of raw materials from Algoi, contain no added sugar or preservatives, um, and are refined with a hay uh, extract. Suttler is a part of the initiative Die Freienbrauer, an association of independent private breweries in Europe. For the Algoi gastronomy and hotel industry, the brewery offers various seminars every year as a part of the Suttler Gastro Academy. In two, uh, 2012, the brewery was awarded the Golden Beer ID by the Bavarian Brewers Association and the Bavarian Hotel and Restaurants Association for their great commitment to training and further training managers and employees. Already in 2004, this award was given for the overall concept of the brewery village in Rettenberg, 
in which the brewery participated together with the Rettenberger Engelbräu. And um, one clo closer look of the label right here. Um, as I mentioned, it's uh, not much around here, just grey and red and um, yeah, not the, uh, not the most that happens on this bottle, but still very plain looking and easy looking and it seems like that's their their style to focus on the on the beer instead. One closer look of the label right here, Gold Export, as you can see it says, and uh, of course V-shaped uh, upper label right here as it often is on the German bottles. Classical looking, here is the back label with information I'm gonna read. So, um, Söttler Beer, natürlich, sympathisch, frisch, Gold, Export, Privatbrauerei Söttler, Rettenberg im Allgäu, Herbert Söttler the First, die älteste Familienbrauerei der Welt, seit 1447, and you see the Allgäu logo right here too, and uh, I've been showing that on other uh, beers that I've been uh, reviewing, for example, Engelbräu, um, Hirschbräu, Allgäu Brauhaus, that's the three other ones that I could think of at the moment, which is having this logo also. Um, since they're coming from Allgäu, the, uh, the place absolutely most southwest in, in Bavaria. Uh, Beer type, export, optik, goldgelb, glanz, fein, geruch, feines Malzaroma, geschmack, kräftige Malznote, schlank im Ausklang. Mundgefühl, vollmundig und spritzig, bittere, 20 Bitterreinheiten, Trinktemperatur, 7 to 9 uh, degrees Celsius, Zutaten, Wasser, Gerstenmalz, Hopfen, gebraut nach dem bayerischen Reinheitsgebot von 1516, uh, 5.3 ABV, which is uh, normal for an export, and uh, export is a beer style that's not as mild as a Helles and not as much uh, hops bitterness as a Pils, still pale. Uh, also a little bit stronger uh, comparing to Pils and Helles. Pils and Helles is usually around 4.9 ABV while uh, an export is uh, like this one around 5.3. So that's not much but uh, still exports are uh, a little bit, uh, some steps uh, stronger and also having this maltiness um, even though they're pale uh, in comparing to the milder hellas and the more hops bitterness and the pills as I said and it's it's uh, really um, a beer style that I love really much the German export style because uh, yeah the, the hellas and the, the pills is having their own different um, tastes and this one is um, something else, this is something maybe in between, uh, have maybe more body comparing to uh, Hellas and more, um, not that strong hops bitterness as a pills. I'm gonna show you the other beers from this brewery that I'm having that I'm gonna review in the future. It's their um, Fest beer that looks like this. Uh, it's their 1447 Natur Trube, which looks like this. Uh, it's easy to call that a Keller beer. And it's their pills. That looks like that. And it's their um, Hefeweizen Hell. Their cloudy Hefeweizen Hell, which looks like that. So, all in all, five uh, beers from the Suttler Brauerei. Um, I'm starting with the gold, the uh, export. And about this specific beer style. I can read, um, Suttler Gold is our flagship. While people drink the most pale Helles in Upper Bavaria and the Pils in Northern Germany, we Allgäuers love our so-called export beer. Golden and shiny, crowned by a very fine poured foam, our Suttler Gold shines in the glass and the fine spicy scent of malt rises into the nose. The fine malt flavors can also be found in the taste, which are replaced by a subtle bitterness. A beer that creates feel-good and enjoyment. Sounds, sounds really nice to me. 
and uh, as I said, I really love export that um, German beer style export. So this is gonna be great, I think. And it's a brewery that I've been uh, looking forward to try a beer from. Um, first time I review uh, or first time I try a beer from a Sutlo beer, and it's been giving a nice impression to me. Feel free to check out their their uh, website and their uh, video, as I'm gonna link to in the description box below, as I mentioned. But time to open this one up. Um, and try the Suttler Beer Gold, oldest family brewery in the world, from 1447. Okay, created much foam there, I don't know why. Let's see if it's possible anyway. Yeah, there we have it. The uh, Sutler Gold and show you the closer look of this beautiful many many small bubbles rises up a nice white head really pale pale golden color of it. Also important to uh, maintain the white foam head uh, while you're drinking the beer because it keeps the beer, uh, keeps the taste uh, just the way it should be. So uh, don't forget that. Maintain the white head all the way through um, while you're drinking. Uh, yeah, I mean look at Look at it again, nice. It looks with the, all the small bubbles. Let's get the aroma. Yeah, easy to feel that it's an export, I think. Not as mild as a hellas, not as hops as a, as a pills. Maltiness, uh, high quality ingredients. Let's taste it, Prost. Really great, really, really, really fresh and um, very well balanced. Really nice uh, bodiness and um, really fantastic quality of the ingredients and uh, really nice brewed beer. Great export, uh, something you should find and try, in my opinion. Definitely not disappointed at this one because it's, it's an amazing taste. Really, really fresh and fantastic. Absolutely great. Strong, um, nice balance between maltiness and uh, the hops bitterness. And it's a really, really well-made beer. Something um, you definitely should try. Um, that's what I can say honestly. It's a, it's a great, great um, example of the, the style and uh, really um, something that um, made a good impression to me, this one. Yeah, so nice. Really, really, really nice. Um, it's get, it's the perfect export in my opinion. So um, this one is a big recommendation. Sutler Gold. Something you absolutely absolutely must try. It's uh, it's really really great. So for me, big thanks to this uh, brewery for making this great beer and I really look forward to try the other ones as well I bet those are gonna be uh, just as mind-blowing as this one and um, it's their um, 
the normal um, the German beer styles that I'm having from this brewery. So I uh, I really look forward to that. And this has been a great moment to try this one. Really nice export. That's something I can say, and um, I hope you trust me on that because, as you have noticed, I um, I have uh, reviewing a few other beers as well on my channel and therefore I know what beers that are good and that's that not are good and this one is really 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 good so for me big recommendation to settle or be a uh, brewery in Rettenberg, Algoy, really, really nice, great in every way. Don't forget to uh, like, comment, subscribe, continue to follow my channel for more interesting beer reviews, and uh, also look at the video of this brewery that the brewery has been made in because it's a nice thing. And um, yeah, see you again soon for another German beer view.